scale an organization when you're growing really fast. Scaling is not just AWS, as we talked about beforehand. Scaling is as much scaling yourselves as individuals, as founders. Presumably, by the time you're scaling, you've gotten through some level of success. Now you're going to hire a bunch of people. How are those people going to have the same success you've had early when you're not actually uh, writing up the keyboard yourself? That comes down to scaling the founder, scaling the culture, etc. cetera. Um, when we started, I'm, I'm very famous on record as saying, if you talked to me about values when I started the company, we would have said, that's ah, bunkers. Let's go make some awesome products and go you know, uh, uh, build things for customers. The more you get into it, the more you realize values are actually super important because they're um, your ethos. So we did this exercise. This is some original uh, 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 screenshots of or photos of, of the exercise. Did an exercise where um, the whole point of the exercise was not writing down values that we aspired to, not writing down basic human values. So you notice none of our values are about honesty or integrity. To me, that's a basic human value. That shouldn't be a corporate value. That's a basic, you know, you get you don't get hired if you don't have that value kind of thing, and I shouldn't have to write on a wall that you should be honest. And I think it's important for founders to understand because quite often you look at something and people go, oh, that's not going to work. And you're like, okay, but what can they learn from that and where can they take that and go on to something else and something else, right? So lots of famous examples. Netflix is a good one. They started with a relatively good idea on DVDs. They laddered that up into streaming because they saw what was going to happen. They've laddered that up into their own content and they've kind of pivoted three or four times, if you want to think about it that way, into a bigger and bigger business that um, obviously dwarfs where they started. Um, and a part of that laddering up, I think, is about never stop being ambitious. So, so Mike, you're a first-time CEO. T tell us about your biggest mistake. Um, there's a lot of them. Uh, okay, failure is a word we should erase. I'm like, exactly. Yeah. I hit that every day. Um, <laughs> uh, probably not understanding people enough and how important they are. Uh, we've been very big on culture and those sorts of things, but... Um, Actually, that's not true. It's probably uh, learning to fire people quickly enough. Actually, if I had to have one big mistake, the only times we've made huge egregious errors is where we've let someone uh, who was a good person in the wrong job uh, stay around for too long just because we were gutless.